Alright, I'm going to be putting this amp gauge in the car today. I don't have a holder for the back of it. What you usually have is like a piece of metal that comes up and across the back and down here and these bolts hold it on. But on this one, because these hook to hot wires, this has to be insulated from the piece of metal. Otherwise, you'll ground it to the dash and short something out. I'm going to make a holder out of this tin can. This gauge fits down in it right nice. I'll poke two holes in the bottom of it, trim the edges of the can around here, it needs to not be, you know, completely covered over because you have these little light slots. And the way you light these gauges, you put a light in the back of the dash and it shines through the glass here. So probably what I'll do is, you know, notch the sides of the cans or something so not to, so as not to mess up that light slot. Uh, I'll get to work on that. I'll show you what it looks like when I get finished and then we'll put it in the car. Okay, I got this made. It's, uh, it might be a little on the flimsy side, but I think, I still think it'll work. Uh, basically the gauge goes in here. I got two little uh, rubber grommets on here to keep it from touching the metal. And then we'll put a screw on the back side of here. This will pull this up against the dash and we'll go from there. Well, I don't know if you can see it down in there or not, but there's the back side of my gauge. A little homemade gauge holders in place. I got it insulated with a couple of rubber washers on the outside. See it's in the dash here from this angle. That's good enough.